Oh, hey there. How do you like the new do, guys? I shaved it today with the help of my friends, uh, the girls from Chemistry and Alexis Kelly Photography. We had a little shoot, had some fun, and uh, yeah, this is the end result. I always remember, I have three brothers, so I always remember like when they would get their hair buzzed, they'd always, touch it, yeah, touch it. It feels cool. <laughs> um, so what better weekend, weekend to say thank you than Thanksgiving weekend. Up here in Canada, we're eating some turkey. Everyone's going to be super tired and super stuffed. And uh, yeah, what better way to, um, to say thank you. You guys have been awesome. You guys really have been. And all the messages, all the cards, everything you guys have sent to me has meant the world. Also want to say thank you to Forever Yours Lingerie and Lucy Clothing and Cherry Velvet and just everyone that's reached out to me. It's been amazing and wonderful. I really can't tell you guys how wonderful it's been. It's hard going through this stuff, really. I have 38,000 people supporting me. And like, I've had a few people message me and say like, I have ovarian cancer as well, or I have cancer, like, and giving me support, giving me all the support in the world. And it's been, it's been amazing, you guys. I don't know why I'm getting emotional about it right now, because I was in such a good mood today, but um, yeah. I want to say thank you to all the people that came into Forever Yours and donated money as well. It's helped me out so much to not have to worry about that. <laughs> I'm still getting used to the hair. It's so weird. Oh, my earring just fell off. It's a cool earring though. I kind of feel like Star trek -y in it. <laughs> um, but yeah, so we're going to have some fun with wigs and we're going to be doing a calendar. Actually, we shot today as part of the calendar. Um, we're not ex exactly sure how it's going to go, but we're going to try and raise some awareness for ovarian cancer because it's really hard to detect this type of cancer. So um, Cherry Velvet helped me do a video on the signs and symptoms of ovarian cancer, which um, I hope most of you guys can see. If you can't look that up on Facebook, try to. I'm going to totally rebrand my Facebook pretty soon here and get everything in order. You know, uh, I'm not good with computers. I'm not good with um, multimedia. And for having only been in this industry for a couple months, um, not even a year yet, I I didn't know how fast it could really take off. I've got lots of people contacting me um, for support and love, and I've had a lot of people just come my way and into my life that have really been uh, such a huge blessing. Oh, yeah. She did such a good job on my makeup, now I'm wrecking it. <laughs> but it's bedtime here soon, so I'll be washing it off. Um, yeah. So tomorrow, I um, I'll give you guys a little update. Uh, if you are just joining my page now, I was like, diagnosed with ovarian cancer this summer. I'm 25 years old. Uh, on August 9th, I had a very large surgery, which I didn't actually ever tell you guys exactly what surgery I had. Um, a little bit because I was nervous about it and also a little bit, um, I, w I don't want to say embarrassed, but it's a hard thing to to share with people sometimes what exactly you're going through and sometimes you can't even explain it to yourself. So I had a full hysterectomy, which means that um, I won't be able to have kids or anything like that. That's pretty upsetting to me. But um, you guys have helped a lot with everything and I'll be able to adopt little babies from all over the world and they'll be my little souvenirs from all the places I'll travel. And um, I'm looking forward to that phase of my life. But right now I've I've got an open road to to do this for a while and um, hopefully succeed in this new avenue that I've taken and this new road that has um, led me to all all the people and much more opportunities coming my way every single day I'm getting new people coming into my life that are just making it better and better so thank you I really appreciate it uh, I've done two chemo sessions already my hair was starting to fall out, so I decided to shave it in an epic way, <laughs> might I add. 
with Pin of Perfection and my girlfriend Stella Lucina and Aaron did my cut my hair. He did an awesome job and I absolutely love it. Um, the reason why I dyed my hair teal was because ovarian cancer uh, has a teal ribbon and I wanted people to ask why I was doing it and you know um, she kind of shouted out loud that you need to be aware of these things and you need to be smart about it. I took the message button off my page because it was getting a little bit too much. Um, with having a hysterectomy, you immediately go through menopause, and I'm going through menopause right now, so I'm an emotional roller coaster. it feels like some days, and like today, I wasn't totally not expecting to cry at all during this video, but um, I guess that's just what, what happened, I guess, I don't know. Uh, tomorrow is my port operation for um, chemo to be in through my stomach so there'll be a small um, tube inserted it's just about a half an hour surgery in and out same day surgery is surgery though I'd like to avoid it um, after this one I hope I don't have any more but uh, gotta happen so that's what I have to do tomorrow uh, I just want to say like I can't thank you guys enough for what you've done for me if you need to contact me for health reasons or if you have something to really honestly say to me then please feel free to email me that's why I put the email up there uh, it's so people can contact me with something something of importance okay I, I don't want to be hit on through email it just annoys me it bothers me and I don't really need it if you want to say some comment to me comment on my photos I read my photo comments I interact with my fans because you guys have made me who I am like you guys have helped me out so much with getting recognized and getting noticed in this industry and uh, I owe a lot to you guys so thank you yes um, so I just want to do this video make it short and sweet I hope you guys like the new haircut I'll try to keep you a little bit better updated uh, but uh, as far as it goes this is this is um, the best I can do right now but stay tuned for all the things to come and um, things to experience. If you're dealing with something, please feel free to email me and uh, send your love and support. Thank you for all the people that have sent cards and um, sent emails with well wishes and everything like that. It's very, very kind of you and I appreciate it all. So thank you. Even if I don't, I'm not able to say thank you on all the photos, Please know that I appreciate everything, and I appreciate all the people that are voting for me in this edition L contest. And, uh, yeah, we'll see where it goes. So, I hope you guys all had a wonderful weekend, and uh, Columbus Day, and all the rest. So, we'll talk to you soon. Have a good night.